So, this is what the corn cob looks like after it's been all set up. So now I'm going to flatten the one end just on the bandsaw before we take it to the lathe. Okay, so that's what it looks like after I actually used the chop saw. I said bandsaw, but I actually used the chop saw. Okay, so here we are getting ready for the next steps. Hey, good morning, Mr. Vince. Just finished setting up the GoPro today so I can film some more turning. And here you go, this is my super stylish uh, workshop camera support. Like, you know, GoPro stuff and a hammer. And advice. That's it. put a glove on. Those things are coming off of there like they're BBs. Thank you. 
getting close start turning the nice around and of course you have to spend some time managing the fibers we'll come back in a little bit okay so this is Vince getting you a close-up here so this is what this thing looks like got a base for it you can see how the corn kernels are coming out and I'll put a little area up here because probably what I'll do is on this end probably drill a hole and they either stick a you know a bottle opener or a coffee scoop whatever whatever uh, somebody asks for something we'll see if we can help them so right now i'm going to sand this baby up a little bit hello so this is where i'm at with it there's a couple of things i want to do different like make sure the corn cob is perfectly straight do a single pour, not a double. This was the first pour, and this part was the second. So I would do a, a single pour. So that's where we're at right now. I've uh, sanded, sanded, sanded. Then I've used my axe sanding paste on it. So I think right now I'm going to give it a shot or two of lacquer. And then I'll probably cut off each end. Okay? This is Vince. Thanks for watching.